Hi, it's Dennis from MobyScribe's engineering team. Lately, we've been getting a lot of questions asking which other styluses work with MobyScribe. So we're going to test them out. Here, for reference, I have the stylus that comes with the MobyScribe. I'm going to write MobyScribe for reference. So first up, we have the Remarkable stylus, which comes with the uh, tablet that Remarkable has. There is no eraser, and it writes. It does feel smooth, a little bit less friction than the uh, Moby Scribe stylus. This is the books stylus that comes with the tablet. It does have an eraser. And let's see. Writing it does seem similar to the Remarkable, and does it erase? It does. This is the Stadler stylus. There is no eraser. Writing it does have a little bit more friction. It does have a uh, decent weight to it compared to the uh, Moby Scribe stylus. This is the HP Pen. Uh, I'm told it's also used for the Surface Pro 1. It does have an eraser and a button. So let's see how it writes. Uh, when writing with the Surface uh, or the HP Pen, um, where you intend to write, it kind of writes to the right of it. And let's see if I push the button. It does actually erase. And if I use the back, it also erases. This is the stylus from Fujitsu. Uh, Looks like the branding on it has Lifebook, it has an eraser and two buttons. Uh, same with this one, when I'm writing it, I intend wherever I intend to write it, it does appear to write on the right side of it. If I push the button, it does erase. As well as the back. It does the rest as well. This is a Samsung Galaxy Note 9 pen. Uh, I'm told all S uh, Samsung Galaxy pets are work with this, uh, but we have one other one for reference, so let's see how it writes. And there is a button, so let's see if it erases, which it does, and writing with it does seem smooth as well. And this is the an older version of the Samsung pen, which also includes a button with it right here, and pushing it does also erase. Thank you for tuning in. I hope this demo has helped you.